The 10th annual Diego Gadea Wrestling Invitational over at South Point Catholic, a celebration of the life of the South Point wrestler who took his own back in 2011. Moved outside this year due to ongoing coronavirus pandemic. Sunny on preliminary Friday, but cloudy and cool on championship Saturday. Let's go down to Diego's mat, 165 pounds. Empire's Braden Peglo going quick and low for the takedown against Mesa Mountain View's Pearson Stahl. Peglo was the number one seed in his weight class at this event, and he did not disappoint taking this match 9-1. The senior is trying to atone for a disqualification that cost him at last year's state championships. I was crushed last year. It was, it was definitely, I was hoping to get my year. I wanted to be my school's first two-time state champ because we haven't had that yet. But it took me a while, but you just got to get over it. And I, say, I would say it made me all, all the more determined this year to win it. The 215-pound Sarita's Levi Pinnell, and he's got silver New Mexico's Jacob Halbison by the leg. That does not look real comfortable right there. Pinnell just absolutely brutalized his opponent in this championship match right here. It ended due to a head and neck injury to Halbison. Pinnell was up 10-2 at the time. That was in the third period. Levi Pinnell, part of a strong showing for Sarita. The Mustangs finished second. But, but I want to know about that leg move we saw. When they're on the bottom and they're trying to come up, you can sometimes reach in between and grab the leg and it just knocks them off their balance. And you can use it to get around. It's kind of a scramble position, not really something that's taught, but uh, it can work sometimes.